One, two, three. I'm driving back east on the interstate to a roadside diner and a sirloin steak. I best go west because I like the view. Nothing looks better than a barbecue. Right now... You're a joke. You're a joke. You don't even know it. It's pathetic. Act like a man. Just do it. Do it. Tell her. Say, Will, honey, you... you and get her to pick it up. She doesn't do it. You're being mad. Big time. Big time loser, man. Big time sucker. Big time. Tell me how it goes. I'm curious. Right. Anybody have a problem with that? You got a problem with that? Here I am. Here I am. Confront me. Confront me. 8720750. Confront me. Call me up. Talk to me. You got a problem with that? Here I am. You know where to find me. Another thing I want to throw out. See, I'm all over the place. It's Friday night. Who cares? We don't need a topic. I don't like to do real radio anyway. You know, I don't want to. I just, it bores me. Real radio bores me. Puts me to sleep. You know, here's the topic. All right, let's have conversation. All right, let's go. Yeah. All right, okay, I agree. You disagree. All right. It bores, Will. Boresville. Don't want to do it. But we got to start someplace. So you have a problem with anything, let me know. Let me know. Here I am. Uh, here, right here. Sticking my chin out for you. Take your best shot. But do that, guys. I'm serious. I, I, I'm your friend. I, I'm here to help you. Find out. I want to ask, this is a generalist overall deep question. Deep question. Both, se both sexes are encouraged to participate. Both sexes. This is a question for both of you. Here's the question. Is man helpless without a woman? Right there, that's the question. That's the deep question. Sit back, analyze it, think about it, drift off into space for a few minutes, analyze the question, and, and come back with a good answer. Here's the question again, in case you missed it. Is man helpless without a woman? That's the question. That's the question. Now sit back, and I want some really good responses to that. And I want some female responses to that, not just male responses. Yeah, right. Uh, not just male responses. Now, is that enough, or do we need more? Now, I've got something else. I'll probably throw it after midnight. See, I don't know what to do. I'm kind of lost. I don't know what I want to do tonight. You ever... It's one of those nights I come in here, and I think, well, just... I'm supposed to lay something out here, and we're supposed to talk about it and get a conversation. I just don't really know what I want to do. It's Friday night. It's after 11 o'clock. I've got access to a 50,000-watt radio station, and I just don't want to waste it talking about something. See, I don't know. I'm just very confused tonight. But that's it for now. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. So here's the deep question again, in case you missed it. Everybody gather around. Here it is. Is man helpless without a woman? Exercise. Guys. You're out on a date with your woman tonight. You're out there. You've got the car radio on. She's probably saying, who is this jerk? This guy's an idiot. Turn the channel, honey. Turn the channel. I know. That, that's the reaction I have on some women. But that's what they're doing. Turn the channel. This guy's a moron. That's because she doesn't like, she doesn't like what she's hearing. It bothers her because I'm speaking truth. She's using you. She's using you. If she does not pick up the bill, she's using you. Get her to pick up the bill tonight. All right, that's what we're doing. My number is eight. And uh, let's talk to uh, Chris. Hey, Chris. Hold on. Hey, Chris. Uh, you're on AM 750 WSB. All right, there's two topics of the ones you mentioned tonight I'll talk about. Sure. All right, one with this um, federal government. Yeah. I think they should get rid of it. Get rid of the federal government. Get rid government. of it. We don't need it. We don't, man. Mm -hmm. it's we just get our, we sta our state can handle it. Right. We, see, we should get rid of it because... Um, the problem is mo the way the government gets formed these days is from lying politicians mm -hmm. and people cheating to get and paying off to get their way up there. That's right. So it's just, just a bunch of liars. Right. And we don't need bunch uh, of we, liars. We, we don't need we don't need to employ a bunch of liars. Right, a bunch of scum. You're at, what was the other topic you wanted to do? The with? other one was about these girls taking them out at night. Yeah. I think you got a good idea, Dave. <laughs> Let them pay for it for one. That's right. That's right. Absolutely. Uh, let them. Well, no, uh, not to you guys. I'm talking to you guys outright. Right now, you're on dates. Not who guys who want to go on dates, but you guys who are actually on dates right now. I'm talking to you. You're with a girl right now. Uh, that's who I'm talking to. I'm talking not guys that want to go on dates 
or dream of going on a date, but actually on a date. You know who I'm talking about. You. It's a lab exercise. I'm just trying to prove something to you. I'm not trying to hurt your feelings. Let's go to uh, Tom. Hey, Tom, you're on AM 750 WSB. Yeah, I just wanted to comment about you and your buddy that were just on coming down on the federal government. Yeah. And I agree there's a, there's a lot of waste out there. No joke. But uh, I think after what we saw, what our troops did in the uh, Desert Storm. Desert Storm, I yeah. I think our money, our money was well spent there. And uh, I think to abolish mm -hmm. the entire federal government, that's, that's crazy. Abolish it. We don't need it. And it will, what are you going to do, it will, man? It, what do you mean, what am I going to do? It won't change my life at all. How's it going to change my life? In fact, it'll improve my life. It'll put 30% more in my pocket. You're going to send the uh, Georgia National Guard? We'll send it? the Georgia National Guard, the Nebraska National Guard. Wake up, man. And, and wake up. No, you wake up. Come out of, no, see, you're just, once somebody lays something on, you feel like you're stuck with it for life. No, no. Right? No, not you, at you all. Right. I mean, the federal, I, I agree, there's a lot of waste, but it's Duh. also built us and made us the most powerful nation in the world. No, the federal government didn't. We did. We, the people, did. We, <laughs> other generations did. We did. But didn't. there's no way 50 states could run the show, man. you got to have a controlled central government. Well, you have one guy, and we ha every state has a vote, oh. and, and then we vote. And you've got and, states and, and, like and, and, Louisiana and Mississippi that can't take care of themselves. Have you ever been on a highway in Louisiana? No, it's I've never joke. been on a highway in Louisiana, guy. Thanks for calling. Thank doesn't have a creative mind at all. He's, he's, uh, I'm offering you something, people, here. It's free. It's free advice. Free. Let's go to uh, Jack. You're on AM 750 WSB. Yes. Um, I wanted to talk about the uh, story about uh, when you go out with a woman. And, Some um, you can't relate to, right? Right, exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, uh, I, I was talking about when you go out and you're spending all your money. Are you with a, Are any. you with a woman right now? Are, uh, are you on a date right now? No. Then I'm not talking to you, guy. Get off my line. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to people out there in your mobile phones. You know who you are. Or, or you're sitting in your apartment right now. You're sitting around. You just cooked you a meal. You're getting ready to go out to a lounge or something. Uh, you're getting ready. I'm talking to you people who are getting ready. You're on dates right now. You're act, you actually have a female with you. Uh, I'm not talking to people who want to go on dates. I'm not talking to you. Um, this is a lab exercise for people who are on dates. And if you are on date, let her pick up the bill tonight to prove she is not using you. Now, is there anybody out there? And I'm going to ask you. I'm going to say, prove it. Put her on the line. Or have her call in. I'll talk to her if she disagrees with me. But I'm not going to talk to guys who dream of going on a date. Let's go to uh, Brian. Hey, Brian, you're on AM 750 WSB. Hey, buddy. Hey. How are you? Good. Well, I, I tell you what, I can't do it right now to put, put her on the line because I just took her home. Because the girl wouldn't, would, she just, she was, you know what I mean. She, uh, I paid for everything, took her out to Houston's and everything. And uh, she mm -hmm. just didn't want to. She wasn't very cool, you know what I mean? But uh, No. But uh, I know what you mean. I just got out of an engagement of two and a half years. You did? Yeah, I did. I bet this is going to be a great story. Oh, man, a story you wouldn't believe. Yeah. I well, unfor down unfortunately, I, I don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear it? I don't want to hear the story. You're going to bore me to tears. You're going to put I'm me to sleep. I'm not going to bore you to tears. I'm not going to You're making the whole thing up. I'm not making the whole thing up. you're making the whole story up. I can give you the girl's phone number. Well, I don't want her phone number. You're making it up. I'm not making it up. Now nah, you're making it up. I don't want to talk to you. Give me some truth here. I want some honest callers. Honest callers. Let's go to... Uh, We're sorry. Gee whiz. Let's go to Mike. You're on AM 750 WSB. Hey, Dave. Mike. Buddy, my dates always pay because we don't play. We quit, we quit schools. They had recess, man. We don't play. Our dates always pay. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't know what you're saying. Your dates always pay. I always pay, man. Hey, but you know me, man. Me, hey, they always pay. Hold me, hold me, Dave. Can you hold on a minute? Two seconds, Dave, okay? Two seconds what? Two, two se hold on a minute. All right, I'm holding. Uh-oh. I think he's really got a woman. What? Dave. Uh, who's this? Are you his date? <laughs> no, I'm not his date. Well, I, 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 mighty strange he went and got you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah. this is Terry from Mary Edda. Hi, Terry. Okay. Yeah? Uh, Are you two happy together? Does, does it embarrass you to go out in public together? Nah. 
Nah. I yeah. tell you what. Yeah. Um, we. What you got to get is some like. I can't say it real loud. You got. What you got to do is get you some dummies, dummy women. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't know what you're saying. Well, I mean to get them to pay, you got to have dumb women. The, the, the small hey, ones won't I, pay. I appreciate your calling, guy. I appreciate it. This is outer man. You people in outer space, not out. Where are the intelligent callers? The intelligent callers. Heard it here a little while ago. The Braves winners in Philadelphia beat the Phils six to one. AM seven fifty WSB News Center time eleven thirty two. Just the Braves beat the Phillies six to one. The latest score we have from the Chicago Los Angeles game out on the West Coast has LA leading the Cubs one to nothing in the top of the fourth. And we'll have a full rundown on high school football scores for you with the news at twelve midnight. How strong Welcome back, David Paul. Friday night. Right. Here we are. All of us. Let me tell you what's going on if you just tuned in. A couple things. Threw a couple things out here. One, the Soviet Union is dissolving. That is great. I think we need to uh, learn something by what's going on over there. They're doing away. I guess the actual Soviet Union will be dissolved and it'll all split up in all their little countries, and I think that's great. I think we need to do the same thing. Why do we need a federal government? Why do we need it? We have a city government, we have a county government, we have a state government, we have a federal government. What do we need it for? Let's do away with a federal government. We'll be the same. We'll have a lot more money in our pocket. All the states will compete against each other. Wow. The competition, prices will come down. You'll have more money in your pocket. You'll have a lot more goods in your home. I think it's a great idea. And then while we're at it, we either need to do away with the cities or the counties. So I think we should do away with the cities because the counties are bigger. So all you will have is a county and a state government. That's all you'll have. You won't need to spend all, these money on ta all this money on taxes. Do away with two governments. It makes sense. We've got too many governments. You've got four governments over you if you're in a city. That's crazy. Let's do what the Soviet Union is doing. I agree with it. I like it. Let's do away with the federal government. We'll all have our own little state militia or whatever, and then if we have any serious problems, we'll all join together and we'll, we'll take care of whatever problem arises. I like it. I like it a lot. I think it's a great idea. We need to watch what's going on over there, and then we need to do the same thing. And... Nobody picked up on this one. Is man helpless without a woman? I thought that was a great question. Is man helpless without... It's a deep thought. Deep thought question. You've got to think about it. And one more thing. A lot of people out there on dates. You're in your cars. You're with a woman. And I'm just trying to point out that you're being used, guy. You're being used. You're being taken advantage of. I'm not trying to start a fight or anything. I'm not trying to do that. I'm your buddy. I'm just trying to point out to you... Let her pick up the bill tonight. If she does not pick up the bill, you're being used. You're being had. You're being taken advantage of. She goes back tomorrow and talks to her girlfriends, and they have a good laugh at your expense, sucker. So tonight, say, I want you to pick up the bill. And if she doesn't do it, it's proof that you're being used. I'd take her home right now. Right now. Take her home. Drive. Turn the car around and take her home. 8720750 is my number outside of Atlanta. 1 800 WSB Talk. This is AM 750 WSB. You're listening to. I'm David Paul. Let's go to the phones right now. Let's speak to Taryn. Hey, Taryn. 
Hey, David. Hi, Taryn. How are you doing? I'm doing real good. Thanks right. for asking. I just wanted to call and say that I, I just don't disagree with... I disagree with what you're saying. What am I saying? About women should have to pay for when, you know, when they go out on dates. I'm not saying... I didn't say that. How, how, how did I say that? I didn't say that. I said as a lab exercise, as proof tonight, if you're out on a date... Uh, have have her pick up the bill. Why? Be because it's proof that you're not being used. If she refuses to pick it up, you're being used. You're being had. You're a sucker. It's proof. It's proof. It's in a, it, it, it's, it's, it's a lab exercise. Well, I don't and think... The outcome, the the outcome proves it. You're what? I'm from the old school. I believe that the men should pay for the women... We know when they go out and, you the know. The old school, can't. you wear dresses all the time, too? Like, 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 no, what is it? No, I don't wear dresses like all the time. Like Mrs. Cleaver? Oh, oh, I see. You pick and choose from the old school. Uh-huh. You oh, pick, you pick, is you is pick. Is that what the, they did? They wore dresses in the old school? That's the, that old, the school. old school. The old school is you wore dresses all the time. So you pick and choose uh, the ones that, that uh, serve you best, right? No, I'm not saying that. Is that, that. It, is that saying, it? I'm just saying that well, I why are, feel... why are you so threatened? Do you have a job? Yes, I do. Well, why are you so threatened by it? Did you go I'm on a not... date tonight? Yes, I did. You didn't pay for it? I was out with Jack. You didn't pay for anything? No, I did not. Uh -huh. Why should I? Don't you like him? Why should I pay for it? When he's paying for it, I don't need to pay for it. I mean, if he's going to offer, you know, hey, is, I'll take, is he, I'll take is, him up for Is he rich? It. No, he's not rich. Oh, he works hard for his money. Oh, yes, he does. Oh, and, and but you get to pocket all your money, and he gets to spend all his on you. He proves... <laughs> He proves his love for you by spending his money on you, but you don't do anything for him. Well, yeah, I do things for him. I, you know, say, say nice things to him. I, I look good at the table where he's sitting, you know, that kind of stuff. You're a good ornament. Oh, yes, I'm very good. But, you know, I just, I just wanted to say that. I just, you know, have to, I've never been on talk radio before. I feel so. sorry. You say your boyfriend's name is Jack? Yeah, he called earlier and you cut him off. I feel sorry for him. He's a loser. He's a loser? He's a loser, man. He's a, he's, a, he's a sucker. He's a sucker. He's a sucker. How many how many times have you paid for the date? Um, probably never. Sucker. I don't he, Jack's in a it. loser. Jack's well, a loser. Why did the Jack's guys keep going out though? What? Why did the guy why would the guys, you know, go